welcome to Chanel Auto Popular. The Mito is Alfa Romeo's first evident supermini since the Alfa Shoot. It's 33, 145 and 147 models having been gone for the bigger family bring forth showcase. What's more, alongside another fragment, Alfa is gunning for another kind of client, one more youthful, hipper and, albeit cognizant of the Alfa mark, maybe not all that tied up in its history. Alpha, to put it plainly, needs to deliver its own particular mini, with which any likeness in the name is absolutely unintentional. Has it accomplished it? To a limited degree. Magnificence is subjective depending on each person's preferences, however the Mito's creators have figured out how to incorporate huge 8C competition styling signs in a little bundle, which is no mean accomplishment. Great practice for when Alpha refined the 8C searches for it littler can the 4C. While the outside draws by and large positive remarks, the inside styling is less firm, and get nearer to the large materials and its obvious quality is some way or another off that of the many. Or then again even the most recent cluster of spending little autos from Korea. Models delivered in late 2013 onwards get a scope of dashboards which change contingent upon trim level. In 2016, Alpha additionally refined the Mito's DNA by giving some outside changes, including to the back guard and grill in advance. Inside was additionally given another rent of existence with 5.0 in touchscreen infotainment framework and driving modes synonymous of its more costly kin. The Fiat Group's 1.4-liter Multimotors motors frame the backbone of the lineup, and are accessible in 138 bhp and 168 bhp conditions of tune. The turbocharged, 4-barrel unit reasonably adaptable and refined. The last is something that is difficult to apply to the twin-air motor. The two-chamber unit has a lot of character, however sounds thrishy and requires steady gear changes to get the best from it. Heading the range is a normally suctioned 1.4-liter oil motor took after by a 103 bhp, turbocharged 0.9-liter unit. Better is the diesel unit, which now delivers in 94 bhp 1.3-liter limit. This was a 2016 motor refresh which gives the Mito more power than its antecedent and deliver less outflows than some time recently. It is likewise a satisfactory entertainer in regard of execution, economy and execution, as long as the rev counter doesn't extend to the furthest points of the rev run. At last, the Mito's flow are hampered by the standard fit DNA framework which spins through three drive modes, adjusting the directing feel and motor yields. Combined with an over-firm ride and ambiguous directing, the Mito neglects to coordinate the fun aura of the Mini. So the inquiry is, can Alfa Romeo's style, character and legacy adjust for various evident weaknesses?